Corvid series was mostly built out of necessity. We built it for short starts, long glides, tough landing areas where you need toggles and hands super fast. Corvid 2 is a faster top end speed, better glide, but still the same beautiful things. That makes a Corvid a Corvid. It's badass. Yes, there are bigger suits in the line that maybe can sustain 0.1 of a higher glide, but they won't necessarily start as fast or as easily and aren't as intuitive a fly. It has a good amount of surface area to be able to sustain higher glides on uh, long terrain flights. It's also the suit I pick up for those short starts where getting the suit flying in the shortest time possible um, is essential. Hey everyone, Cody Matichuk here with the Corvid 2 from Squirrel. First off, Corvid 2, faster inflation than the Corvid 1 and uh, get a full inflation across your wingspan as well as your tail wing. So that's really nice. It's faster, more precise flying. Everything just feels like it's uh, a little tighter tuned. Whew, man, I'm loving this suit. For real. It's uh, feeling faster. Flares are feeling bigger and smoother. The start, dude, friend, let me tell you, it's 1001, 1002, just perfect inflation. I can just put it out at whatever angle I want. It's gonna stay there and start flying. And uh, that's the kind of suit I wanna be flying in a technical environment like Moab, or really any short start all over the world. Uh, the new Corvid 2 is a new design. It's a monochamber design. That means it feels a little bit different in flying. It took me 20 to 30 jumps to figure out how to fly the suit. But uh, now after 60 jumps, I think I can say I really love it. Uh, the new Corvid 2 has a little bit more power than the Corvid 1. Uh, it flies a little bit more efficient and efficiency means you can fly faster, you can fly further and you can fly longer. So these are the main benefits of the new suit. Easy to fly, it has super good starts, it has super good glide. And uh, the flare at the end is unmatched, so I never had so good flares. Uh, as with this suit and I'm super looking forward for the upcoming seasons. So see you soon at some exit point and uh, ciao ciao. Yeah, I mean it's just uh, it's the go-to suit for wingsuit base jumping for me. The biggest thing I noticed at first is the mono chamber. You feel the suit inflate a lot faster off the exit, so you gain control of the suit quicker. You're gonna notice that it's faster, better glide, bigger flare. So yeah, it's not the biggest suit, which is one of its benefits. It starts really good, but it flies like a medium sized suit. So it'll be really good if you're coming off of a freak or similar size suit, it'll be easy and intuitive to fly.